Hello and welcome to Cruise Passenger News, our weekly roundup of the world of cruising, brought to you by cruisepassenger.com.au. This week saw one of the busiest of the season with all the major lines sailing in every state in Australia, bringing tens of thousands of tourists from all over the world. Our first wave season since the pandemic has been declared a big success. The next season, which starts in September this year, is already shaping up to be even bigger. A cruise passenger survey of travel agents has found that cruise prices have never been cheaper. We've spoken to some of Australia's top agents and they tell us prices are actually falling and that this month and next are the best times to bag a bargain. But the big story for Australian cruise fans this week took us by surprise. Have you ever considered retiring on a cruise ship? Our story about a couple who have been living aboard a ship for $150 a day had thousands writing in to ask how they can do it too. This week, we'll be revealing the cruise lines where long-staying cruise passengers are most welcome. So sign up for our newsletter to find out more. Our reporters have also been investigating tips and gratuities and how they can deliver a nasty surprise at the end of a trip. But there is a way to save hundreds of dollars while still keeping great ship crew happy. Fancy cruising with a superstar. Virgin Voyages, soon to be sailing in Australia, has signed up JLo as a cruise director. Will she be on your voyage? And finally, Carnival Luminosa will play host to an extremely exciting new itinerary, taking guests all the way from Brisbane to Seattle in the USA. This 31-day epic represents a chance to soak up all the fun of a carnival ship and stopping off in some spectacular destinations. To find out more, go to cruisepassenger.com.au. See you next week.